Good morning. Pastor Steve here today. Um, it's the start of uh, might be our last beautiful day for a little while, so I thought I would come outside and uh, just share my thoughts with you this day um, and give you some devotional thoughts. I'm going to be using uh, uh, a hymn. I'm not going to sing it. Um, I don't do well a cappella by myself, but um, I want to share this hymn with you because it's a lovely one, and it's part of the reason that I'm out here enjoying the sounds of the birds and uh, just enjoying nature. I'm sorry for the shaky camera work. It's called, This is My Father's World. This is my Father's world, and to my listening ears, all nature sings and round me rings the music of the spheres. This is my Father's world. I rest me in the thought of rocks and trees, of skies and seas, his hands, the wonders wrought. This is my Father's world. The birds their carols raise, the morning light, the lily white, declare their maker's praise. This is my Father's world. He shines in all that's fair. In the rustling grass I hear him pass. He speaks to me everywhere. This is my Father's world. Oh, let me ne'er forget that, oh, the wrong seems off so strong. God is the ruler yet. This is my Father's world. Why should my heart be sad? The Lord is king, let the heavens ring. God reigns, let the earth be glad. It's a wonderful, uh, a wonderful hymn, fun to sing, and it has such a great message. It reminds us of one thing that we ought never forget. God is the ruler yet. This particular hymn says, though the wrong is oft so strong, but part of, uh, part of what we need to remember is not even when it's the wrong, but when it's just things that seem to be in charge, like coronaviruses and things like that. Um, God is the ruler yet. You know, it is a scary time that we're living in right now, and, and people are sometimes a little crazy. I'm, I get a little crazy myself once in a while, and uh, we're challenged. One of the challenges we need to remember, or we need to think about, is that even though it seems like you know everything is going wrong, uh, it's not. God will make good come from all of this if we just watch for Him. I mean, yesterday, I I uh, talked about seeing God in every day. Well, one of the ways you can do that is what I'm doing right now. Um, it's a little brisk this morning. Supposed to be nice today, though, and warm. Um, go out and listen. Listen to the sounds, to the birds singing, to the wind blowing, to the grass rustling, and the trees moving back and forth, and their branches rustling and rubbing against each other. You know, we don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> the coronavirus can't stop that. Those things go on because it's part of God's creation and part of who God is. So please, friends, um, in the midst of all of this, take some time to get out, to get a little fresh air. Uh, from what I understand in the forecast, it's going to get a little fresher the next few days, and possibly even some of that nasty white stuff. But, you know, it's all part of God's world. So get out and enjoy it. Um, take a walk, go for a drive in the car. Uh, if, you, uh, if you like, get your coffee, set out on the deck, the front porch, the front yard, the driveway, just get out. You'll be surprised how much better you feel when you feel God's nature all around you. So, remember to enjoy, to feel the freshness of the air, to know that God is the ruler yet, in spite of what it seems like in this world, and go and enjoy some time. And now as I enjoy a little time here with, uh, with some of the things of our church, there's our bell and uh, our little 
sign that uh, shows the different stages of the old church building sitting outside enjoying the fresh air and God's creation. I hope that I can have some of you see me this evening as we finish up our uh, Jesus, the God Who Knows Your Name Lenten series. It'll be a, sort of a recap of what we have looked at over the past few weeks. Uh, and also join us for Palm Sunday. We're, we're planning some big things and hopefully you can join us and uh, we will also be having palm branches available at the church uh, very soon so you can come and pick up your palm branches to remind you of that great day. Until then, God bless and take care.